Flyweight division. These guys, same age, very similar in height. We've got Muay Thai against Kumkamai as Indonesia takes on Cambodia. 115 wins and 18 losses. Training out of Salapak and FFG, representing Cambodia. Put your hands together for Chan Rotana. And now, introducing his opponent, he is an Indonesian flyweight champion, standing at 170 centimeters tall, holding a mixed martial arts record of seven wins and two losses. Training out of Golden Camp and Pitbull Academy, representing Indonesia. He is Rudy the Golden Boy. Rudy Augustine in the red as these two flyweights get started. John Chilson alongside Gianni okay. Suba. Nice leg kick landed by Rudy Augustine as he works back. Ends against the ropes as Chan Rotana. Chan Rotana's bubble underhook. As they're going to step outside. Gets the sweep. Nice body lock takedown thrown by Rudy Augustine looks inside the guard of Chan Rotana. This is exactly where Chan Rotana did not want to be. On his back with a ground and pound specialist, Agustin throwing arms on him. Chan Rotana staying very active on the ground, landing those short elbows. Chan Rotana's got very active elbows. He's got sharp elbows. He's finished a lot of people in Kumkumai with those elbows. Look for him to throw him here right immediately on his back. Rudy Augustin doing a good job of keeping, keeping his head in the middle, trying to get inside bicep position. Now you can see Chan Rotana's doing a great job. Holding his head down, controlling the left arm, the right arm of Rudy Augustin. Not allowing any strikes from Augustin. He's controlling the head, playing off the bicep. Nice little throw there. Needs to have his hips swiveled, needs to have his hips on one side. Have a little bit more leverage. Rudy looks content to stay in the guard here, not looking too much to pass. Well, he knows just how explosive Chan Rotana is, so if he does try to create that little bit of space, he knows that Chan Rotana is going to start to frame off the hips like he's doing with his feet, push away, and get back up to his feet. Chan Rotana with the right foot on the hip there, creating a little bit of space. Not sure what he wants to do, but Rudy Agustin looks to push down on the leg and pass. Almost able to do it. goes to the back. Very sneaky move by Rudy Agustin to pass. Oh, hooks it. Great job of Chan Rotana rotating inward, stopping the advancement of Augustine. Rotana with an underhook of his own right now. He's got a lot of experience in Gunkumer, so he knows what to do in the clinch. Good job working his way, turns back to the corner. Possibly looking to separate here. Rudy Augustin does not want to let this chance go. He's got that clinch. Wants to keep nice and tight. Wants to look for the double underhook and look for the little outside trick that he got in the beginning of the round. Like that short little elbow. Chan Rotana threw his lands a nice right hand. Rotana striking real well, really well off the break here. Chan Rotana likes to stay a little bit flat footed because he throws so much power into that right hand. So you can see him plant his feet right in front of his opponent. But what that does is it gives Augustine the opportunity to close that distance real quick. Chan Rotana looked for a little clinch sweep right there, but end, ends up on his back. Rudy Augustine passes on the left side already. You can see oh, ends up in side up. control. He's got to be a little bit tighter in his escapes. He's got to make sure he does the right things when he tries to move away. He can't just try to get up sloppy like that because Rudy Agustin is just got all he has to do is fall forward, which is what he did. Right. Chan Rotana here still has half guard. One foot on the hip there. Chan Rotana's foot on the hip is stopping the advancement of Augustine. Augustine wants to slide to the left side, go into side control. But Chan Rotana's doing a great job of framing with his legs, not allowing the advancement of the pass. 
by Augustine. You can see the foot on the hips right there, which is what Giant Soup was talking about. He's not allowing uh, Augustine to take that left leg and slice through the middle of his of General Tom's legs. Nice and grounded pound thrown by Rudy Augustine. to keep the bout. He wants to keep the bout with him grappling, not allowing Rotana to look inside of the double leg. Look at these finishes. Tarantana does a good job of sprawling, getting his hips back. It's small, but tarantana has got to move. He cannot stand it's right in front of Rudy Agostini. He's looking for that one big shot. But Rudy Agostini is relentless in his takedown attempts. Good job by Chan Rotan to stay back up, though. You can see Rotana is not conceding position. As soon as he gets taken down, Rotana is looking to pop back right away. Rudy Agostini might be starting to fatigue a little bit. All these constant takedown attempts are starting to wear him down a little bit. He's also demoralizing him because the way that Chan Rotana is able to pop back up. As Look at Chan Rotana. As, uh, as Augustine starts to fatigue, it will open up the strikes for Chan Rotana. Soul of Rudy Agostini is flared through the Go. corner at him. Look at that. Nice little straight right hand to a left hook combination. You see Chan Rotana starting to get a little bit light on his feet. Now he's starting to move around a little bit. Not so flat footed, not so planted. Rotana knows that Rudy Augustine is fading a little bit, so he's using his footwork here, not allowing Augustine to time it for the takedown. Chan Rotana misses on a big leg kick as he lets out a little wail. Rudy Augustine lets him know he appreciates that shot right there. As soon as Rudy Augustine closes that distance, gets into that striking range, Chan Rotana throws a big right hand. Chan Rotana is not afraid to throw combinations in three rounds. He has the conditioning to do that. Like that body kick. Like he's starting to work in this way. Rudy Agustin might be starting to fade. There's no takedown attempts coming. Nice hand combination thrown by Chan Rotana. This is what Rudy Agustin wants. Rudy Agustin wants Chan Rotana to commit on the striking exchange and look to another chain drop it. Looks to be the pressure of the two as we're approaching the three-minute mark of the second round of this mixed martial arts contest. I like the leg kicks, I like Chan Rotana throwing those leg kicks. It's gonna slow down that shot attempt coming from Rudy Agustin. Tonight he's throwing that uppercut from way back from Phnom Penh. Chan Rotana doing a great job of doing long-range strikes, not overcommitting, not allowing Rudy Agustin's sure. space to clinch up. Nice little fake there. Beautiful left kick, straight right hand combination. This is not the same Rudy Augustine that we saw in the first. He expended a lot of takedown as he runs right into a knee. You have to think, Mitch, is Rudy Augustine trying to conserve energy for the third round, trying to push hard? Not a good strategy against Chan Rotana, who's known to be able to go three rounds. But Chan Rotana is pacing him apart right now as he catches the kick, throws him to the ground. Here comes the grounder pound by Chan Rotana. Oh, Rudy Agustin's got to move. Chan Rotana's going to go right past this guard, right into the side control of Mount. Big right hand landed. Augustin not doing much in terms of defense. But that's it. He needs to lock up Chan Rotana here. He can't just defend. He's got to intelligence to defend himself. Otherwise, Kim Chang is being forced to jump in and stop this. Try to slow down the attacks of Chan Rotana. Try to get it under her. Good job. At least Chan Rotana is still able to lock in a guillotine. Chooses to switch around and take the back. Keeps punching. Oh, beautiful ah. stoppage. Chan Rotana found his moment and let Rudy Augustine know. It was the takedown. It was the ability to stop the takedown, get up from the takedown. And then once he had Rudy Augustine broken, he jumped all over him with huge ground and pound. Rudy what Augustine a victory. Pushed a little bit too hard in the first round. Did engage his conditioning, put too much on the first round, and Chan Rotana poured on the pressure in the second round. Kept his range really well, never allowed any opportunity for Rudy Augustine to get his grappling in. And as soon as 
Chandra Tana took him to the ground, landed a barrage of strikes. Rudy Agustin covering up here, not intentionally, de intelligently defending himself. Here, on the back position, unanswered right hands. Referee has no choice but to stop this bout. Impressive performance from Chan Rotana. Let's go to Dominic Lau. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee, Mr. Kemp Chang, has called a stop to this contest after two minutes and 50 seconds in the second round for your winner by way of technical knockout, Chan Rotana. Chan Rotana, winner by second round TKO. Huge victory for Cambodia's own. Chan Rotana. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a night packed of epic martial arts action. Do not go anywhere. The card from Jakarta, Indonesia, one championship for honor is just getting started, ladies and gentlemen. Don't go anywhere. Chan Rotana.